The stochastic oscillator is a momentum indicator. Similar to the RSI, this indicator measures overbought and oversold conditions in the market. Typically, the reading above 80 level shows overbought and below 20 oversold conditions in the market. The indicator consists of two lines. The K line compares the latest closing price to the recent trading range. The D line is a signal line calculated by averaging the K line values. So how to use this in your trading? Using the overbought and oversold readings in a range bound market. In a range, we buy when the D line is rising out of the overbought area and we sell when the D line is coming out of the oversold area. Using the line crossovers in a range bound market. In a range, we buy when the K line crosses above the D line and we sell when the K line crosses below the D line. Using the overbought and oversold conditions in a trending market. When the market is trending upwards, you wait for a retracement lower and an oversold reading on the stochastic indicator. You buy when the D line is rising above the 20 level. When the market is trending down, you wait for a retracement higher and an overbought reading on the stochastic indicator. You sell when the D-line is falling below the 80 level. Remember, always stay with the trend. When the market is in an uptrend, you only look at buying opportunities. And when the market is in a downtrend, you only look for selling opportunities. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss our next video about MACD and check out our other latest videos.